Hello everyone, The Winning Way, that is a book, I have brought it for you. And uh, sports and business, are they related? Or as a matter of fact, war fields and business, are they related? Yes, sports strategy, war field strategy, and sports planning, business planning, sports execution, business execution, sports winning business winning so we have a couple a well-known couple Harsha Bogle and Anita Bogle they have jointly written this book the winning way a motivational book well welcome to simply inspiring channel this channel is meant for young learners and let us get into this particular book well people who follow cricket cannot ignore Harsha Bogle. Harsha Bogle is a well-known figure in, among the cricketing fans, cricket fans. Well, he and his wife, both of them, they have graduated from IIM Ahmedabad and these two couple successfully conduct numerous training programs for the companies. What do they bring to this, these companies in their training program? The learnings of sports and its implications or its adaptation in business. Harsha Bogli being a well-known commentator and his wife being a business graduate and a practitioner, both of them have a lovely combination of bringing sports strategies and the ideologies and apply to the business. They have conducted uh, numerous uh, training programs and in this particular book, what they do, they speak about individual skills required and team skills required. Broadly, this book has been divided into two parts. One is you as an individual, be it a sports person or be it a person from the business, what are the skills are required? So, Harsha Bogle and his wife, they list down the skills that are required and they also link very cleverly these are the skills required for a sports person that is the reason they are successful so they have given a lot of stories and stories about cricketers particularly the leading cricketers captain i mean Dhoni, ganguly and many likes and similarly teams winning teams once upon a time australia was known as a winning team and later India has taken over the winning uh, style or the winning philosophy. So Harsha speaks about the winning team of Australia, the winning team of India and their practices, their ideologies and their tactics. So this book is a, a it's an interesting book and this gives you an idea because Harsha Bogle was very closely observing different teams, different players, their planning, their execution, failures. Failures is an important, is an important ingredient for anybody who wants to succeed. So there are so many things to learn from failures. So as I said, this book wherein individual skills and team skills and both skills, how this applied, this was applied in in sports and how this can be applied in business. When I read this book, I recall another popular book, Extreme Ownership by Jacko Willings. This particular book, Jacko was working in US Navy SEALs. So he brought a lot of learnings from the war field and then he applied that. He tried to apply that in business and he also, started, I mean, working as a consultant. So there is a close relationship between extreme ownership and the winning way they are parallel harsha has taken the learnings from the sports and jacko willings he has taken the learnings from the uh, the uh, the field the the army or the war field well this book is an easy read and you can relate because he has given numerous Indian examples 
for youngsters particularly or entrepreneurs this book is going to be a very good book a sort of a guiding book this book has been uh, given uh, given forward by uh, mr mukesh ambani so mukesh ambani has written forward and rahul dravid has written last word a very nice well compiled book very good book i enjoyed this book and if you like this channel please subscribe it and communicate about this channel to your friends thank you for your continuous support